what's up you guys so today I thought I would do an ipsy bag I want to say unboxing but it's kind of more like an unbagging but that just like sounds weird so whatever so this is the month of January's ipsy bag it kind of like I feel like sometimes they try to make the bags go with like the months like for like summer sometimes they have like summer themed bags like I got like an ice cream themed bag once so I feel like they kind of try to go with the months. I've gotten like Halloween ones before. But I feel like this isn't like wintery. I feel like this is more like summery. Like to me this is like a beach bag. And it almost kind of feels like that kind of material. So I don't really know. But whatever. I like it. I think it's cute. So let's see what I got. So for Ipsy you have to like fill out a profile. If you didn't know this already. You have to fill out like a profile and like say like your preferences on like things so my profile is like crazy colors and stuff like that so that's like the gist <laughs> so first off I got something hair related and I don't do random hair care things because I'm boring and like I don't like do anything in my hair I usually have it up like it's up more than it's down just because like I just don't feel like dealing with it and especially in the winter it's like so staticky and just like uh, I just want it like out of my face so I traded my hair product to my mom for one of her products <laughs> so <laughs> um, she used to have an Ipsy subscription but she was getting too many products that she canceled it because she couldn't like use them up I guess whatever I don't know so this is from a past Ipsy bag that my mom got that I traded for a hair care thing that I got in my January bag, if that makes any sense. So I'm gonna start with that because this didn't come in this bag. So this is from Teeny Beauty and I have like a lip thing in this like same container except it's a lip product, not an eyeshadow. So this is Firestarter eyeshadow and my mom has like a collection of things that she doesn't want that I'll like trade like things to her like usually like random hair products that I get because I'm not into hair products I just do like dry shampoo and like that's the only thing that I put in my hair besides like shampoo and conditioner so um whenever I get like a hair product I just trade it with her and I get something that she doesn't want so this is the color I know it's kind of hard to see because I'm filming at night but I'm sorry <laughs> but it's like this really pretty like shimmery maroon shade I don't know. I just liked it, so that's why I picked this. Boom! Okay. Now on to the other stuff that I got. I got a foundation brush by, I think, is this? Oh, Billion Dollar Brushes. That's what it is. Um, and it's very soft. It's, very, it's cool because it's, like, gray. I don't know. It just it reminds me of Angel because she's gray. So, I don't know, it's so soft, super soft. I know I don't usually do, like, foundation because I'm just, like, a concealer and powder and you're good to go type of person, but um, I have another brush that's similar to this, but it's, like, really cheap. <laughs> so, um, this will be good for if I do, like, face masks because I, I do face masks more than I do foundation, so I'll like paint it onto my face with a brush. I prefer to use brushes than my fingers. So even though I don't usually do foundation, I'll probably be using this for a face mask. So that's nice. I always get like so excited when I get brushes. Like brushes are like my thing. Like I just love brushes so much. And then I got a Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 hour full coverage foundation which I'll probably just like kind of use as like concealer <laughs> like I just don't do foundation um and this is in fair sand I don't know it's just like my skin shade whatever I'm like the palest of the pale <laughs> even in the summer like yeah and then I got I feel like this is a lip topper it doesn't like say exactly doesn't even really say exactly what it is but this is Bell in Argent. Is that like a different language? I don't know. I don't even know if you can like read that. But I feel like this is a lip topper because like that's like a thing. And it's like kind of yellowy beige with like pink sparkles. Might be like kind of hard to tell because my lighting kind of sucks. 
but I don't know. You can see it the best that you can. So I feel like this is like, oh wait, lip something gloss. It's in like a different language, so I think it's French. I didn't take French, so couldn't tell you what it means. Um, but I feel like this is a lip topper. So, I don't know. I've never heard of this brand. It doesn't really smell like anything. Like, really anything at all. I love the smell of things. Especially, like, mascaras. I don't know why. It's, like, this cute little thing. I don't know. I think it'll be interesting. Because it has, like, a really pretty pink shimmer. I'm, like, trying to screw it off. It's not going on. Angel! Stop snoring. And then, last but not least, funny story. So, this is a nail polish by Color Club. And in the shade Feverish. It's kind of funny. I got, like, two, like, maroon things. Like, I know I didn't get this in this bag, but it's, like, two maroon things. And so, funny story. This is, like, a nice dark maroon. I have been watching, like, crazy obsessed nail polish people who have like whole nail polish rooms do nail polish declutterings and I've been like I don't know why it's so interesting to me but they like go through like every single nail polish and they have like 8 million brands and I was watching this one video and this lady did like two different brands like per video and they're like 45 minute long videos and she goes through like each individual shade and she like compares shades and says oh this one the formula sucks or oh I don't like this one because of this reason or oh I like this because of this like she goes very in depth and I'm surprised at how well she knows like each and every nail polish like it's kind of like insane but whatever and she was saying when she got to color club I had never heard of this brand before and she was saying she loves this brand so much because they have like a good formula and it's very opaque and like she had like such good things to say about it and then like literally the next day I got my ipsy bag in the mail and I opened it and I was like color club ha ha I just like heard about that in a video and it had good like reviews I guess you could say good vibes from this lady who was decluttering her nail polish and I just thought that was really funny because I was like "Ooh, this I have good hopes for this so I don't know that was just funny to me so Ta -da! and also I've been like this is weird so I used to be very into painting my nails I used to be into like nail art like back when that was like a thing <laughs> like back probably when I was like 13, 14, 15, like, I was, like, the nail art girl, people knew me as always having, like, perfect nails that were, like, I don't know, whatever, and then for a while, I just didn't paint my nails, like, these past, like, one or two years, I, I don't know if I just lost interest, or I just don't have time, or what, but I've, like, barely been painting my nails, and I painted my nails white last week, and all week, I was just like, this is so weird. I can see, like, my nails just look so, like, I don't know. Just, like, I just kept noticing it, and I was like, oh, I like this. So I painted my nails again, and they're just, like, purple with, like, these ones have glitter on them. But I'm, like, into painting my nails again, so I don't know. Maybe I'll do, like, a nail video. I already did kind of, like, a nail video. I did, uh, I feel like it's not gel. Or maybe it was gel. I did some nail video. Maybe that kickstarted my whole obsession with nail polish again. I don't know. Whatever. So, I don't know. But I'm very excited for this month's bag because I got cute things. Probably, like, my favorite thing that I got out of all of this is probably the brush. Just because I just have a thing for brushes. Just, I don't know what it is. I just have a thing for brushes. And this one's so soft and it just reminds me of Angel. And I don't know. I just... Who's snoring? Rude! So, I don't know. I This is probably my favorite thing. Plus, I've never heard of billion dollar brushes before. But, I mean, they sound good. Billion dollar brushes. Um, it's so soft, though. I just want to, like, touch it. ASMR. <laughs> I should literally try doing an ASMR video. Like... I'm not one of those people who's like into ASMR. Like I don't, I just, I don't get it. It's, it doesn't do anything for me. 
So I should try ASMR because I'm not into ASMR and try doing a video and see like, I don't know. I thought that would be a funny video idea. Someone who's not into ASMR trying to make an ASMR video. So, I don't know, whatever. So, if you have any thoughts um, on my video on my Ipsy bag products, comment down below. Do you have any opinions on these products or these brands or Color Club? <laughs> um, if you do, comment them down below because I'd be very curious to hear your opinions. So, if you like this video, please leave me a big thumbs up. I am sorry my cat has been snoring through like half of this. I guess she's just sleepy. Are you sleepy? <laughs> She's like, yeah, I am. Let me go back to sleep. So, if you're not already, hit that subscribe button, turn my post notifications, and give me a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!